And what are you studying now? Uh, engineering and mathematics at UQ. And I'm in my first year of engineering and maths at QUT. Yeah, I enjoy specialists. Probably, it was very different to methods. Methods was um, kind of, it was all like the same kind of topic, like derivative integrals and there was some trigonometry and like basic graphing. Um, whereas specialists, yeah, like you got a, a wider variety of things to do. Okay. It was like matrices and things like that. Um, so that's the yeah. main difference, like methods. It was just one big topic. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, it felt that way, um, but it was still fun to do. Like, obviously, you got probably more a wider range of questions for each topic in methods. Def I definitely I did enjoy it a lot, and especially when um, some of the content from specialists overlapped with methods and methods with specialists as well. That was good because it made it easier in terms of study load. Um, but the content itself was very interesting. Okay, cool. So that was like that good crossover that you yeah. found beneficial? Yeah. Everyone has to do two like mathematics courses for engineering um, at uni. And they, they build upon specialists mostly. Um, there's a bit on methods, but mostly build on specialists. Um, and then obviously you do separate, se separate engineering courses, um, but they're not focused on the maths as much. Yeah, and, and that is true, you can do the maths degree without specialists but they sort of go over concepts that you learn in specialists so having that familiar familiarity there do they go like faster or yeah okay so i guess one part is they assume you can integrate which i guess you learn in methods as well yeah but another one is matrices so while they do cover it in a couple of weeks this i found it very helpful to have that um foundation, that foundation yeah so you can cognitively understand what you're launching into already. Okay. Okay, nice. Yeah. So, yeah, possible without, but very helpful um, okay. to have it. Yeah, yeah. Um, there is a, you have to complete, if you want to do engineering, you have to complete a specialist. And if you don't do it in high school, you have to do a, 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 you have to do a follow-up course for first year. Um, so yeah, it's definitely, it was definitely worth doing a specialist. So you're glad you did specialist or? Yeah, glad, definitely glad. It was, oh, it was okay. definitely yeah, fun, more fun than I think um, other subjects would have been. I'd definitely say yes. I think, at least in my grade, the ATAR scaled pretty well. Okay. Um, so that was very helpful for me doing, only doing four general subjects. It was good having those um, decently scaling subjects yep. to work out well. Yeah, yeah. And then in engineering, so far, uh, I'd say since I'm doing a double degree, I'm only, I guess, doing some of the subjects. Yep. But so far, I guess it would be the techniques that you learn. Yep. Um, however, with the math degree, uh, the specialist has been absolutely like, fundamental and oh, okay. very, very necessary. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, so if you're doing uh, just a math degree, I'd say it would pretty much have to do specialist. Oh, wow. Just to give you that kickstart.